Now, KOAT, Action 7 News, live at 10. Coverage you can count on. Action 7 News told you about the theft of a woman's priceless family heirloom. See the emotional moment where she got it back and how our story made it happen. Also, now to an Action 7 News exclusive. Eight days ago, we told you about an Asleta Pueblo family devastated by the theft of a family heirloom. They feared it would be hacked up and sold at pawn shops. But it turns out tonight they have a new faith in the human spirit. This is Elizabeth Kirk's early Christmas, and Rami Salem is her Santa. Just so excited at the same time, I just broke down into tears. Earlier this month, this bear claw squash blossom necklace was stolen from Kirk's truck. It's worth $250,000 and means everything to her family. Kirk feared it would be ripped apart and sold for a quick buck. Once we saw it was gold, my wife uh, was the one dealing with them, and she said, you know, that's, that's very weird, that's very different. Salem, the owner of National Jewelry Buyers on Manal, was suspicious. So as the young man and woman wanting to sell it to him waited in the front, he did a quick Google search in the back. When we did that, uh, your guys' report came up immediately. A New Mexico family is crushed after a unique and very valuable heirloom was stolen over the weekend. We said, oh my goodness, you know, this is it. Salem bought the piece for $1,000 and called police. APD then contacted Kirk and told her the necklace was safe. It didn't have a scratch. She believes in goodwill again. These wonderful people who actually recognized it and took it upon themselves to purchase it, not knowing they were going to get the money back or not. She did pay Salem back, though he says he did it for this reason only. It was the right thing to do. There's more to life than business. You know, and we, we know that God is watching, and we know that uh, in the end, you know, you'll get rewarded. So even if we, we bought it and we didn't see that money back or anything, it didn't matter to us. It was just a matter of getting it back to the rightful owner because it's as simple as we, we would want the same to be done to us. An honorable deed that healed a family's heartache just in time for the holidays. Well, the suspects are a man and woman in their mid-20s. There is surveillance video of them, and police are investigating. Now, Salem says the KOAT story that we did is the reason why he knew that that necklace was stolen.